Chris Johnson, Blue Collar Outdoors. Today we're going to be doing another waterfowl pattern test with the tried and true Dakota duck and goose. All right, now this is the Dakota duck and goose, the three inch ounce and a fifth two shot going 1,550 feet per second. Okay. I'll be shooting this today out of a Benelli Vinci with a Briley extreme range choke tube at 40 yards. Now this gun has also had the forcing cone lengthened on it to throw better patterns. So it'll be interesting to see what it does with this Dakota duck and goose at 40 yards. All right, now today it's a little bit colder out and we got like a 20 mile an hour breeze, maybe even a little more, so. 20 mile an hour breeze? <laughs> yes. A it's a breeze. Breeze. I don't know, what do you think the gusts are? 30. 25? I bet 30. you're 30. Yeah. yeah, trees are swaying at 30 mile an hour. Uh, you can probably hear in the audio that we've got a little bit of a breeze today. We're trying to block that out the best we can for you, but it is what it is in these situations. Doing this all for you guys. I just had to throw the pretty card in there. All right, Dakota Duck and Goose, 40 yards. This is going to be sweet. Locking her down. Focus on the mallard's head. Yes. Good? Yep. That one really surprised me. Huh? I said that one really surprised me, so I know that should have been pretty good. Okay, rolling. Woo, that went all right. All right, after shooting the Dakota duck and goose at 40 yards, once again, it throws a great pattern. I mean, the bulk of my pattern hit a little bit low, but I mean, this is also not my gun. It's just a gun that I borrowed from a friend, just so we can get more patterns on film for you. But I mean, the bulk of your pattern's down here. Well, that's extremely tight for 40 yards. I mean, on your main target, you gotta, Enough hits there to kill the duck, or at least knock it down, but if this were brought up to the main pattern, nothing's gonna survive flying through that. All right, there's a couple voids in this pattern. I mean, I mean up high you're gonna have some voids because of my pattern shot low. I mean, you got a little void here, a little bit off to the right there, but not too many, nothing too concerning. It's just a, a good round for anything you wanna shoot it out of, truly that we've experienced. All right, but for now, this is Chris Johnson with Blue Collar Outdoors. If you haven't yet, like and subscribe to our channel. We upload every Monday and Wednesday, and soon we'll be back to our normal Monday, Wednesday, Friday, whenever this weather turns around for us. And make sure to hit that notification bell in case we do drop a random video here or there. But for now, we'll see you on the next one.